Hey everybody and welcome back to the channel. I did want to uh, welcome you again. Today we have a special machine to talk about and it's been one that's been lurking in the backgrounds for a while and uh, now is its time to shine. Um, in uh, other news, um, being as we are in the eve of May, uh, some of you may even be watching this on the 1st of May or another day in May. I'm not sure. Maybe you watch it on the day I upload, maybe you don't. Not a problem. If you're watching, I'm happy. But either way, May is my birthday month, so I figured I would do a series of vacuum cleaners. Um, I do have a commercial machine I'm gonna pull out, um, but what we are going to look at specifically for the month of May is Hoover vacuum cleaners. Um, that may be promotional models or private labels or uh, maybe just things that you just don't see very often. But either way, we are going to take a look at a really cool machine. So I'm going to get on to the uh, video. Okay, so for today, I thought I would pull out this awesome Hoover convertible. This will be the second Hoover convertible on the channel for those that have been watching. Um, but this one is a very special promotional convertible. Um, now, we're going to go back to 1974 with this one, as you can see. Uh, the bag as well as the colors are very indicative of the time. We saw popping colors and floral and all kinds of great stuff. This one, no different. So this is a 1974 Hoover convertible model U4017. Uh, the U4017 was a bottom of the line vacuum cleaner, but it did have some interesting features. Uh, that were quite different uh, and make this one a little bit more significant than others. Now, the 4017 was actually a promotional model that was made specifically for Ace Hardware. Um, now, Ace Hardware did date back to quite a way, ways before this, um, but they did have a contract with Hoover to make some machines for them uh, that were a little bit different from the uh, conventional Hoovers you'd find at an authorized dealer. Um, but uh, Ace did get some uh, interesting machines, this one included. Now, what they basically did for this machine was it was kind of a smattering of other parts. Um, things like the, uh, the bag. The bag is actually uh, the same bag that you would have seen on uh, a convertible model 1076. I'll show a picture right here. As you can see, that's the same bag uh, that you would have seen on it. Uh, it also had things like the handle from a U4001, um, which would have been uh, another Hoover upright from the same time frame because it did have a handle grip. Uh, normally, you wouldn't see a handle grip on a uh, Hoover convertible like this because, uh, well, bottom of the line machines, they generally didn't have uh, deluxe features. Handle grips like this usually would have been on a deluxe machine, uh, as well as things like a headlight uh, and a zipper bag uh, versus uh, button snaps. Um, so uh, as well as things like a, you know multiple uh, height adjustments for the floor, uh, just kind of more features equals more deluxe. Um, but this was a bottom of the line machine. Uh, basically Hoover just used what they had lying around at that time. Um, they were uh, really just kind of utilizing uh, whatever they had. So uh, they came up with this for Ace Hardware. Now true value, uh, because they weren't quite the same thing at the time, uh, they also had one very similar to this, uh, but instead of this color combination with the kind of the dark uh, tan or taupe uh, hood uh, and the, the kind of this light tan body, they had it, the, the body was actually the same color as this uh, and it had a yellow hood that kind of matched a little bit more with the, uh, the bag here. So that was a U4035 uh, for those out there watching. Um, but uh, uh, actually, I do have a picture, uh, very small, but it is a picture of the ad for that one. It's uh, show right here.
So, as you can see, it's kind of an interesting machine. They're not very commonly found. Um, generally speaking, you would usually buy a Hoover from a Hoover dealer. So, um, you know, whenever you would go in to find a, a vacuum cleaner, you know, Ace Hardware, I don't think was necessarily the most uh, uh, prevalent when, when acquiring a vacuum cleaner, at least not here. Um, so, uh, this one took a little bit of finding, and, uh, I was able to, to get this one from Jared Martinson, so a big thank you to him. Um, but it needed, uh, some cosmetic restoration on it, so I went ahead and got that done. Um, but, now that we're here, I'm super happy to have it. Uh, it will be going into storage soon, so I'm super glad to share this with you before it has to get put away for a little bit. But, uh, let's get on to the run demo. All right, let's go for a spin. Alright everybody, I hope you enjoyed our little run demo as well as a short history lesson on the 1974 uh, Hoover Convertible Model U4017. Uh, this fantastic blast from the past is definitely a fun machine to get out uh, and test drive. It certainly looks very interesting anyways. So um, either way, stay tuned for the next video. We will, like I said, be doing a month of Hoover. So stay tuned and we will catch you in a week.